Hi guys, Wiley here, and today you join me for an unbagging. This was from Cavity Colours. They had a sale on. Um, selling off a few of their pins and t-shirts. So while I was working, I had a little bit of money. I thought, well, you know, I may as well give it a go and try and find some really cool things. Um, I would have done this video earlier, but I had to go down the uh, post office to get it because there was a custom charge, which really peed me off. You know, don't don't some of these American, don't some of these companies, you know, realise, you know, that us in the uh, UK pay enough for shipping in the first place without having to pay another bloody eight quid on well 15 quid on top which is ridiculous so i'll put the t-shirts there the t-shirts i'll do last i show the pins off first there's only two uh yes sticker here's the cavity color sticker pretty cool sticker That's really cool. Had a pretty, pretty cool. I'd seen this before and it was like fifteen dollars or something stupid and I thought I ain't paying that. Uh now it's five dollars, so I thought yeah. It's quite a heavy as well actually. It's a shining pin. Shiny one as well. And Jack Nicholson with the pattern across his face. Looks like he's been run over by a carpet cleaner that's a really cool it's quite a heavy pin as well so that's cool um and in the next one again this one was um 15 dollars before only five dollars now so i was like yep yeah, cool i'll have that and we have that's pretty cool the details pretty cool we got the freddy pizza i mean the detail on it is really really good that's a cool pin. So that's a really cool pin. There were two really cool pins I got. And then I got two t shirts. What's that? So look at this one, how this one turned out. So look. Oh, that's really cool. Oh, that's, that's cool. What do we think? It's called Horror Circle. The colour on it is amazing. You know, in detail. You got basically your horror icons, you got Jason down the bottom and there's a few other pieces, bits and pieces of people you can see. Um really cool t shirt. Really cool t shirt actually. So oh, we've got a little flyer. Little bookmark. That's pretty cool actually. Thank you for supporting Cavity Colors. We are so happy to share our passion of horror with each and every item we create and send your way. Now that it's in your hands, we hope to provide the nostalgic feeling of your favourite horror movie on VHS or favourite Halloween candy. Share your pics at Cavity Colors. I might uh, post this video on their wall. Oh, that's, a, that's a really cool uh, bookmark, actually. we got Doc Decker from um, Nightbreed. We got Boone and that. Still not a lot of uh, not a lot of things for for Nightbreed. Um, I'd love I'd love some figures. Come on, Necker. Come on, McFarlane. Or even Mesco, actually. So yep. So that's the first T-shirt. Uh, what I really like about the Cavity Colors T-shirt, I've got a I've got one other color to Cavity Color one that my good friend, uh, my bestie across the pond. Uh, Marie uh, got for me. It's um, a gremlin one, but it's got all bits and pieces on it as well, which is pretty cool. And then the second one, I saw this and I was like, oh yes. <sighs> See, we've got beep beep on it, right? Tell me what you think. I'll give you guys a look first. How awesome is that? How awesome is it? That is amazing. I really like the colour on this t-shirt. 
I'm a big it fan. There's not there, there's a lot of people out there that don't like it. Fair enough. Um, I do. I like the first part. Second part I wasn't impressed with. See now that's pretty cool. Why couldn't it be like that instead of what it actually is? I mean, behind you can see actually what it is, but why couldn't it be something like that? That'd have been so much better. That's a really cool design. And it's actually got on the back on the thing it's got beep beep that's pretty cool I like that so yeah um I'm like recording again and while he's here yeah what do you want hmm well it's not for you he's been lying on one of my t-shirts over there <coughs> you know it's not for you hey eh? it's not a new bed for you to lie on you little bugger come on in hey eh? it's not a new bed for you to lie on hey eh? it isn't no matter with you. No matter. Hey, stupid cat in you. Hope everybody's doing okay. I've not been feeling too good. Uh, I've been feeling a bit low. Um, been in a lot of pain. Um, had a really, really awesome day in Breen the other day with um, Anna and, and Sarah and Adam and, and the kids and that. It was a beautiful day. I've got the sun and my hands and my arms. Um, but it was a really, I mean, it was beautiful um i'm hoping well no i'm going to i'm not going to hope i'm going to um in the six weeks holiday me and my good friend lee um he's got a youtube channel um lee and the Spro ellen sproggs i think it's i think it's called um but yeah we're gonna he lives not far away from breen um we're gonna meet up in the six weeks holiday and you know which will be really cool um I'm really looking forward to that. He's been a really good friend, I've got to admit. Um, I'll leave a link to his channel down below. Go and check his channel out. Go and give him some love. Tell him Wiley sent you. And this Wiley. Um, and, you know, he, he's become... Uh, well, he's become a rock, to be perfectly honest. You know, he really has. Um, you know, if, even if it's just a, you know, message. You know, just a, you know, you're all right. There's been a couple of people actually that's been like that. Uh, my other, my other good friend, well, my other bro, little bro Lee. You know, he'd always been supportive and always shares my videos, and I really appreciate that. Um, my friend Dave as well. Uh, he pops up and checks up on me and says if I'm okay. Um, watches all my gaming videos and what have you. Um, so yeah, I'm really, I'm feeling really. Even though I've been really quite low and, and in a lot of pain, I'm feeling quite lucky as well. Um, today's been quite difficult. You know, it's been seven years since I lost my stepdad. Um, even though we had our ups and downs. And he was the one that actually kicked me out of home at 16. So, you know, you think, well, why would I be upset? Or, you know, whatever. But I was a, a pain in the ass when I was younger. Um... I mean, I never did drugs or, you know, anything like that, or I never got police involved, but I was, I was a handful, you know, and I must have been really hard work for for, for, for both of them. Um, and, you know, he always he always said that I wouldn't amount to anything and, and this, that and the other. Anyway, before he died, I got a chance to go and see him, um, and we sat and talked for, for quite a while, and he told me that he was proud of me. You know, he was really glad that I proved him wrong. Um, Apologised for the way he was. Um, so I got a bit of closure. You know, he, he was always trying to uh, build bridges between me and my mum. Uh, because me and my mum don't get on. You know, I don't think we ever will. Um, but he was always trying to build bridges, you know. He was always trying to, uh, you know, get us back together. Um, you know, he tried all sorts of different things to, 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 to get you know to get us back together. And, and, and none of them worked. And, you know, and I, and I respect him for that. You know, at least he tried. Um, so today's been, been a hard day. You know, I've been thinking about... You know him as a person, and you know that I was. I just feel really lucky that I, 
I got a chance to um, sort things out before he died. So I feel good. I feel happy. I feel good about that. I do feel good about that. Anyway, I've rambled on like I always do. Um, drop a like on the video if you liked it. Let me know what your favourite item was. Um, I always like to uh, chat down below in the comments. Um, there will be another video. We can subscribe, which will probably either be here or here, wherever I send send it. It'll be either side. And there will be a video that will pop up on the video on the screen, mostly down this corner. I try and put it, and while it's back up again, there'll most it'll be a link to my last um, unboxing video. What I'm trying to do is, as I'm getting better at the channel, I'm putting links to my older videos. So I'm doing a, if I'm doing a gaming video, the links will be down, you know, on the screen around wherever I can fit them. So you just click on it and go to the next one. Um, that's what I'm trying to do with my unboxing. So, like I said, it'll be a subscribe, either this side or this side. And there'll be my last video, either this side or this side, whatever I decide, decide to put it. Um, oh, off, bloody, being attacked by every moth. Where'd you go? Oh, off. Tap by a moth. So, yes, I will catch you all on the flip side. Bye, yeah. Bye, guys.